What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Cancer, and you enjoy my content, um, and you enjoy my guiding mouth and my videos, you can smash the sub button, be notified for future content. The same. This is hashtag glow up for the sign of Cancer for November of 2021. This covers an APF Cancer, any aspects of your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. Uh, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Okay, so I got one channel message in as I was meditating on your hashtag glow up for November. And the message is neophyte. Neophyte. N-E-O-P-H-Y-T-E. -E. I had to look it up because honestly, I had no clue what a neophyte was. I didn't know. So I looked it up. So for everybody's on the same page, neophyte. Per Google Dictionary, looking it up on Google, a person who is new to a subject, skill, or belief. For um, example, sentence in this was four-day cooking classes are offered to neophytes and experts. So, a person who is new to a uh, new to a subject, skill, or belief. So, neophyte, you're um, this could be you new to a subject, skill, or belief, or somebody you're connected to some kind of neophyte energy new to something in some shape, form, or fashion, which that, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that at all. Um, everybody um, has a starting place to learn in some shape, form, or fashion. You, all, you have to start somewhere, you know. Um, you just don't ever come into anything knowing everything about everything. I mean, if you, um, that just isn't the way it rolls. So, I mean, there's nothing wrong with being a neophyte, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. Hopefully, it's something positive and um, hopefully somebody's not dabbling in the dark arts. I didn't hear that. I didn't hear that, but I'm just saying we were pulling dark arts today. So I was just saying, so hopefully not that, but, um, you plug it in how it resonates. I was going to tell you guys while I'm shuffling out, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. Every single like, subscribe, share, um, unlike, and donation. Um, if you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. Thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. You guys have truly just been the best. You really, really, really have. Um, you really have. It's really helped a lot. So thank you guys so much. I just want to make that very abundantly clear real quick spirit messages you have on a cancer okay cancer Some new in cooking, some re religion versus spirituality. Okay, I heard some new in cooking and some religion versus spirituality. So some of you guys are new to cooking. Cooking, So I guess you might take a cooking class or maybe you're going to look up some recipes and try. Um, well, if you're new to cooking, well, maybe you're going to. Make something very easy, I'm presuming, first. Maybe pull some eggs and make sure they don't burn. Or, and I'm not trying to be funny. I'm not trying to be funny. I'm really not. But if you're new to cooking, it might be something as simple as boiling some eggs or boiling some tea bags or something. Um, well, however that resonates. Or maybe you're taking a cooking class. I heard cooking and religion versus spirituality. So for some of you guys, I think you're viewing tarot card readings. I think you're new to spirituality, spiritual realm. Um, and you're checking out the spiritual realm. I think you um, are comparing it versus religion. We had similar S-type messages in Aquarius's. I just want to throw that out there. Sure did. Um, it's not bad in the spiritual realm, you guys. I know uh, some uh, some people give the spiritual realm a horrible, horrible name. They call us the devil and all, all kind of crazy stuff. But there's two sides to spirituality. There's light side, there's dark side. Light side is light side. It's no dark arts. It's readings. It's 
um, inspiring and healing, or helping inspire and heal and motivate the collective. Dark Arts is putting crazy confusion spells and voodoo spells and hexes and money blocks and all kinds of crazy crap on people. Um, no, nay, nay, nay. This is completely light side. I just want to make that very clear for anybody. Uh, if you're just checking out my channel and you're you're comparing religion versus spirituality, this is completely um, light side. You're safe here, just saying. <laughs> but um, but yeah, so there is two two sides of spirituality. But you can be religious and be evil too. Just want to throw that out there. It's how you grow and manifest yourself. Um, and that's just the truth, for real, for real. Whether you choose to be spiritual or religion, it's how you grow and manifest yourself. If anybody needs to hear that, so. All right. For some, you can be dealing with a fire sign because we have fire sign energy in here. If you are, they can have an Aries, Leo, or Sag, and there's some moon rising, Venus, North, and Venus, or Jupiter. Because um, Coyote Spirit is fire sign energy. Trust in divine detours. A particular cancer is about to do something they never thought they were going to do, but they are going to do it. Have had strong, strong intuition to do it. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, if this resonates with you, I've heard I heard you. Um, you're going about to do something you never thought you were going to do. Um, I heard you've had strong, strong intuition to do it. So your gut and your little voice inside you that says "Don't do this" or "Do this" is telling you to do it in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, however that resonates in your life, um, I heard you are going to do it. You are going to do it. Your little, your intuition, your inside voice is basically telling you to do it. So it sounds like you're about to do it because your, your intuition's, um, help, not hounding you, but urging you to do it. And all, yeah, intuition, you know, we all have intuition for a reason. Absolutely. Now, some people choose to ignore it and some, some don't, but we have intuition for a reason if anybody needs to hear that. So, um, trust in divine detour. So, I think that's um, the detour of your intuition basically pushing you to do this. I heard you never thought you were going to do it, but your intuition is pushing you to do it. So, whatever it is you never thought you were going to do, you have to plug that in your life however that fits for you. For some, I feel strongly feel to be dealing with fire sign, Aries Leo Sag. But you plug it in your life, however that fits, if that resonates for you. Inspiration, be prepared as you'll soon receive a visit from the fairy of inspiration. Come dusk or dawn, she can call at any time. Someone gives you huge inspiration. You never gave this person credit in the past. But you're about to pay it forward to this person in a huge way. Well, this is beautiful, Cancer. Um, I heard someone gives you inspiration in a huge way. You never paid it forward to this person in the past, but you're about to in a huge way. Um, whoever this person um, of your past, it sounds like, that gives you huge inspiration in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, you never paid it for, forward to this person in the past, but I heard you're about to in, uh, in a huge way. So you go with your bad self. Healing. Now is the time for you to give or receive healing. Everyone has a natural ability to heal others. Yes, even you. A particular cancer is about to put up their dark arts ways after a series of chain of events are about to occur. It's about to go very badly for them soon. They're about to hang their dark arts hat up. Oh, oh my God. Okay. Well, okay. For the new neophytes new to the spiritual realm, this is a good example. Okay. This person has been doing dark arts for a long time. Okay. I heard this person's been doing dark arts for a long time. Okay. So their experience. Okay. This is a good example for you neophyte um, cancers. New to the spiritual realm. This person has been doing dark arts. This cancer has been doing dark arts for a long time. I heard a long time. So I, a long time. So I'm thinking five plus years, 10 plus years. You plug it in how it resonates. But they've been doing it for a long time. 
something is about to happen. Dark arts always backfires for anybody who doesn't know. It always backfires, either a little bit or a lot. This case, it sounds like it's about to backfire a lot. This person is very experienced in the dark arts realm, apparently, but it always backfires, either a little or a lot. This case is about to be a lot, so much so they're about to hang their dark arts hat up. So, I heard they're about to go from the dark to the light, but it's because some kind of spell or spells up they're about to do on the dark side is about to backfire on them. Now, dark arts can either backfire on you or somebody you're connected to, but whoever this cancer is, it's about to backfire on them. So, they are technically healing reversed because they are not a healer. Now, for some, they could work in the uh, 3D realm and pose as a healer, like a nurse or a doctor or a healthcare professional, but they're really not in the spiritual realm. Uh, I'm not saying they are. I'm not saying they work in the spiritual. I'm not saying they work in the healthcare profession. I'm not saying they do. I'm just giving you an example that people pose. Pose in the freaking world all the damn time is what I'm trying to say. But who they are behind closed doors are different stories. And this person is a dark arts person behind closed doors. Just seriously. But it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. So they are healer reverse. But once it backfires on them, it's going to backfire in a huge way. I didn't hear specifically what kind of way. It's going to make them go upright because it's going to scare the hell out of them so bad is what I'm trying to say. So healing. Let me see if I hear anything else. But that's just an example for the newbies joining in. If you're afraid this is like the devil's work, it's not. It's actually the opposite. That crap is the devil's work. Um, just let so you know. A particular cancer is about to be released from the hospital soon. Lots of healing here. And a particular cancer's child is still healing. Okay, I heard a particular cancer is about to be released from the hospital soon. Lots of healing here. So, so physical healing. Ment uh, it could be mental healing, physical healing, both, um, spiritual healing, um, healing, which is always good in the upright, not dark arts, crazy, reversed, just saying. So healing for this person, they just, uh, as it sounds like they're about to be discharged from the hospital soon. They've been hospitalized for something. And another cancer, um, oh, what was the other one? Ooh. Oh, I heard their child is healing. Their child is healing. So if this resonates for you, Cancer, your child is healing from something. So, so very traumatic experience. Okay, I heard a very traumatic experience. Oh, dear God. Okay, so your child has some kind of very traumatic experience and they are healing. So it could be mental healing. It could be physical healing. It could be both. You plug it in how it resonates. But that third one resonates with you. Your child has healed from, is healing from something very traumatic. So healing. Good and good. Good for your child if that resonates for you. Movement. Fast, 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 fast movement for a particular cancer soon. They are about to have a huge wake up call. About to seriously help now. Okay. Heard fast, fast, fast movement for a particular cancer. Um, serious wake-up call. They're about to help now. So, um, in this sense, movement is physical movement. Like, you're moving fast, fast, fast. Because um, you're about to help on something now. Someone or something. For some, I feel it could be a fire sign. Because you have fire sign energy in here. Um, and Aries Leo side. If not, it could be some. It could be your child. For some, it could be your child you're helping. That has um, recovered for something very, very traumatic possibly. You plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, good for you. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. Dance classes for some. Yoga. Okay, I heard dance classes for some yoga. So some of you guys are going to take dance classes and it sounds like yoga classes. You go with your bad self. I, I want to do yoga. I want to get back into it. You go with your bad self. All right, fair man. Dealing's a relationship with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair.
This person is about to be very, very significant in your life soon. Some get justice for family. Some get justice for your child. Okay, I heard this person, person is about to become very, very significant in your life soon. Some of you guys, it sounds like this person is about to get justice for your, your child. I think this child is healing from a very traumatic experience. And for some of you guys, this person's going to get justice for family. And for some, it's both. And for some, it's both. Okay, so this person is very significant. It sounds like they are a very fair person, like a true fair person, not a fake false mask fair person. Um, for some, I feel they could be a judge or a lawyer, a judge or a lawyer, um, possibly. That's what I'm feeling because I heard get justice, some for your family. I mean, I'm sorry, not for your family, some for a family, some for your child and some for both. So uh, I feel they could be a lawyer or a judge is exactly what I think. Or an investigator or an investigator, lawyer, judge or investigator, or it could be a police officer on the light side. Now, you know, there's dirty cops out there. We all know that there's dirty cops just for real, for real. But not all police, um, police men are, or women are like that. And that's just the truth. It's how they grow and manifest their, themselves. Um, but this person truly is a good person. They truly are. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. They um, could have blonde, gray, or white hair. I strongly feel it's a lawyer, a judge, an investigator, or a police, um, somebody who works in the law enforcement community. That's exactly what I think. A cancer is in deep regret of the past. They are about to make a very, very, very important phone call for this family soon. Okay, I heard a cancer is in deep regret of the past. They're about to make a very, very important phone call for this family soon. So um, this family is very significant in your life in some shape, form, or fashion, cancer, um, if this resonates with you. Egg, success assured with good plans and hard work. Lots of success is going to come to one particular cancer through lots of hard work and perseverance. Some a business, some building a home. Oh, okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, I heard lots of success is going to come um, with lots of hard work. Some of you guys, it sounds like you're building a home. So from the ground up that's awesome my dad built a barn from the the ground up many 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 moons ago he's been passed away a long time but buddy he was awesome so um if this resonates with you it sounds like you're about to build a home from the uh, ground up congrats to you and some it is uh, a business so some building a business from the ground up some building a home from the ground up you go with your bad self you're very handy whoever that's for that's awesome. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. A particular cancer is about to hear of a death soon. Of an ear sign. Toxic air sign in your past. It's going to spur you to do something a lot faster than you thought you were going to do. Communication. Okay. If this resonates with you, I heard you're about to hear of a death of an air sign from your past. So a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They could have, it could be masculine or femme, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They could have um, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, and there's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Aver, Jupiter. But they are a masculine or femme, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius of your past. But you're about to hear of their death soon, if this resonates with you. And um, I heard it's going to make you, um, spur you to deliver some kind of communication faster than you thought you were going to. So it could be communication to help this family. It could be communication to help your child. It could be communication maybe to a fire sign because you're pulling in fire sign energy. 
It could be communication to this fair person that's going to help you, some with the family, some with um, your child, some both. Um, and, well, you've got spur of communication and you've got movement. Move, 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 move. Just saying. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. This is a good one, Cancer. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. I didn't. I didn't. Okay, you guys. I love you guys. I hope this helped. If you think if you think anyone else could benefit benefit from these messages, please share these videos on your social media. Um, and word of mouth, I very much appreciate it. Love you guys so much. Namaste.